Dan Willis here and we're looking at credit repair and what it is. Credit repair is a broad term that is typically referring to correcting your credit reports. In general, you are trying to remove negative information from all three of your credit reports. This is important because when your FICO score, FICO rating is determined, the negative marks on your credit report are taken into account. This will impact your score by roughly 40% and it is called your payment history. But you thought credit repair was illegal? That is a common myth. However, you can have items removed from your credit report. In 1970, Congress passed the Fair Credit Reporting Act, FCRA, and have periodically updated this law. The most recent update entitles you to get one free copy of your credit report from each bureau annually. The FCRA has provided some important rights and rules for our credit system and to you, the consumer. Number one, an item can remain on your report for a maximum of seven years. However, this is regularly violated as the time your debt starts to age is often manipulated. For example, let's say you have a credit card that you stop making payments on. By federal law, this debt begins to age from the month you stop making payments. After six months, the credit card company is going to sell your debt account to a collection agency. Now the collection agency is going to view your debt as a new account, and they are going to report to the bureaus for a full seven years from when they purchase your account, despite it already being six months old. If this agency doesn't collect, they are going to sell your debt account to another debt collection agency, and they will continue to contact you for collection. The size of your debt directly impacts the number of times it will be sold to other collection agencies if it is unpaid. As you can see, it is common for one financial mistake to spiral into multiple negative marks on your credit report. It is also common for collection agencies to view your debt as a brand new account whenever they purchase it, and they will try to keep it on your report for a full seven years from the day they purchase it. While this is illegal and you can file a consumer complaint to the FTC or Federal Trade Commission, it is common practice in the debt collection systems and clearly you must take action and perform some credit repair. Number two, you can dispute any item on your credit report you feel is inaccurate. In other words, you can dispute any item and the credit bureaus must investigate it. They will contact the lender and get verification on your account. To file a credit report dispute, you must write a letter to each credit bureau. In your letter, you need to include the item you are disputing, the reason, and the dates. Once the credit bureau investigates, a result letter will be mailed to you. In this letter, they will inform you if the item was verified or if it was removed from your credit report. Often, investigations result in the removal of items because many lenders are unwilling to spend the time and manpower to verify old non-collectible debts. Using the aforementioned example with the credit card company that sells your debt, once they have sold it, they have no legal right to collect on it. Therefore, it is only going to cost the credit card company money to keep the records of your account and even more money to have someone physically verify the account for the credit bureau investigation. Many lenders are unwilling to do this because there is no benefit for the company. For more credit repair tips, please visit the link in the description below for some more articles at our website, yourbadcreditcard.net. This is Dan Willis. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Please like this video. Please have a fantastic afternoon. Please check out some other videos on our channel and looking forward to talking to you again soon.